All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching ReZero Season 2, Episode 17. I've got nothing to say for the start of the episode, but I'm really looking forward to this episode after what happened in the last... Um, in the last couple episodes, anyway. Um, but, uh, yeah, as always, like the video if you liked the video, and subscribe to the channel if you're new, and let's get into the episode right now. Who's this? Who's this that's talking right now? Is it Puck? Is Puck speaking? Hmm. Starting out to be what seems like it's going to be a really good episode. <laughs> I like how cool and chill and calm um, Amelia's been in this situation. She answers it, she's answering and like presenting herself like Subaru does. <laughs> I quite like it. Ooh. This is the princess room. What is this? Oh, this is little Amelia. Oh. Mother Fortana. Oh, younger sister? Oh, okay. Then it's not her mom, but. I see. Okay. I was confused as to why he was saying from my brother then. <laughs> Look at her. She's baby. Look at her. She... She's always had this pouty look on her face. Oh, Osaka. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. If you meet these people, they're gonna... They might hate you. Ah. Uh, I recognize that voice. I really recognize that voice. So are these guys the witches cultists? Like, they're dressed the same, right? But they, these guys seem really nice. I don't get it. It's nice that we get to see some more elves, considering there's like no other ones in the show, I think. Unless I'm missing anyone. Wait, is this Bertigals? Bertigues or whatever? This is what he. This is him, isn't it? What happened? Gues, Bertigues, or whatever his goddamn name is. I completely forgot. I was like, his hair looks familiar, but his name's Gues. Bruh. What? Because, yeah, this is from the cult. They're all dressed in cult clothing. What the hell? What happened? What happened to him? What? Is it the same guy? It is, right? I just don't... I recognize the voice, but I haven't heard him in a while, a long time, obviously. <laughs> you gotta get home, kid. You gotta get home. <laughs> You're all scruffy. <laughs> just get clean, bro. Oh. Oh, nice little clean fairy. <laughs> all over yourself. Somehow. Oh, this loving mother-like figure. So nice. What happened with these elves and Bertigues, man? What the hell? Yeah, that's all I was thinking. She was getting influenced by Subaru. She's becoming more confident in herself and the way she speaks and stuff. Wait, so this wasn't her face in her past yet? How's that? I love the little cute little noises she makes. Us. <laughs> I love young Amelia. She's so cute. Oh, damn. I wonder if these two had a little thing going. Maybe this is what drove Bertigues insane. I'm still very confused. But this is an interesting plot line. The Jews not back up. Arch not back up. <laughs> ah, she's so cute. What is the seal? What is the seal? The two of who? The two of who? Hello, little fairy. <laughs> Young Amelia was so cheeky. So cute. Ooh, what is this? Oh, there's baby Amelia. Why do I feel like it's going to be a mistake to open this up? <laughs> oh, Subaru. <laughs> who cares? <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. It's nice to have Garfield on this side now. <laughs> oh, these three would make a funny fucking friend group. <laughs> I love this. Why do I feel like she's gonna open this and something... Bachi, bachi, bachi! And something bad's gonna happen. <laughs> the sky red and the forest white today. Oh, to be a child. <laughs> Could it be the smell of incident? <laughs> I'm glad she didn't open the thing. <laughs> it was pretty bump. <laughs> What's wrong? I mean, does he think it's the Witch of Envy? Or does he know it's Amelia? What? Oh, God. I feel like he thinks it's the Witch of Envy or something. For what reason? For what reason? I'm very confused about this situation. I'm just trying to piece together what I think is is going on. Amelia is really grown, man. I love that. I love this. Oh, okay, he knows. Okay, the situation's changed now. He knows it's Amelia. I just, I don't understand. Baby Amelia is such a menace. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Ada! Oh, I really like uh, Fortuna. Oh. Cry, baby. <laughs> Damn. That's deep. <laughs> Cry, baby. I can't believe this is potentially Berta Goose. Or probably Berta Goose. I don't get it. What happened? Oh, yeah, she does have a specialty of a. Uh, Talking to spirits, doesn't she? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Don't kids just say the darndest things? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> hummer, hummer. 
I'm so sad about whatever happened in the future. This is, these two fit really well together, and Amelia's so happy right now. What did what did he just say? I missed it. Hontana <laughs> Hontani. Oh, she's actually adorable. Oh my god. Oh, such a good kid. Is this Arch? Who? Who? Oh, we don't know who this is. Oh no. I don't like the situation. Don't like it at all. Have we already met this dude? Did we meet this dude at the start of season two? Is that one of those dudes? I don't remember. Yep. Yep. I remember him. I remember him. Yep. Oh my god. Well, shit. Um, I, I believe I remember him uh, from the start of season two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's one of the characters that showed up and wrecked that whole wagon troop. I don't know. Um, but uh, yeah. Oh boy. What a very cute episode. What a very nice cute episode. It's a shame something horrible is probably going to happen in the next episode to kind of ruin this. But it was really nice to see uh, young Amelia. To meet um, Mother Fortuna and to see Bertigils, I believe. But before the time where he's insane uh, i think like it's a confusing story so far but it's really i mean it's interesting as hell to see all this and whatnot so i mean yeah i'm really looking forward to seeing what comes from this now um but yeah, that's all I really have to say. Overall, a really good episode. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice day and peace out.